Gone! Roach is running a riot! Yes, same line! The levels are the same line! What has impressed me about him is the way he has gone about this game, his level of consistency, and also his approach to the game and working things out that suits him and sticking with that. Um, I mean, it's just tremendous the work that he's put in and the success he's reaping at, at present. And as Kurt mentioned, I just want to wish him all the very best. He's a very, very easy guy to work with. I've enjoyed my stint with the team generally, but this is about Kima Roach now. He's very easy to work with, listen a lot, which is important, try to do what I ask him to do, and never try to go out of his comfort zone and try to do things that he don't think he can do. I used to challenge him a lot. That kind of way, you know, I want to take X amount of wickets or X amount of runs, that kind of thing. And trust me, never an issue with him. He's easy to work with. A guy I have a lot of respect for and will find time for him any day. So I want to say congratulations to him, Johnny 200 Club. And from Curtis Ambush to you, Kima. The next step is 250 and then 300. Remember, I tell you that. All right? Kimar, heartiest congratulations for your wonderful achievement. Um, it just shows the hard work you've put in over the years. Um, you're a stalwart in this dressing room, went to West Indies cricket. Was there for your first game in Barbados um, in a rain infected T20 game. And I hopefully will be around with you for many other years to come. Um, remember stepping on the field with you for the first time. I always admire the way you carry yourself. You were cut above the rest. Um, coming onto the scene, you were express pace, 145 plus. Now you're just down uh, a little bit in pace, but you've peaked in, in skill, you know? So I would always emulate your style. Um, you've led from the front, and I wish you nothing but continued success. And I hope that you have a couple more years left in the tank that we could step on the field together um, a lot longer. So all the very best and thanks. Just want to say congrats on the 200 test wickets. Um, I think that is a mighty achievement. Um, seeing, just looking at the way you're going about doing your work, looking where you prepare for matches, I think it's something really great. Um, uh, it's been a pleasure opening the board with you over these years. Um, I don't think I could ask for a better opening partner. Um, just the way about how, about how you go about doing your stuff. Um, it's great to see. Um, I wish you all the best and hope you can achieve many more. Hope you can reach the 300 mark and I'm here to support in any way possible. Perot, partner, my partner. Um, I just want to congratulate you, you know, on that milestone of reaching 200 test wickets. I know that you are a hard, hard worker. You know, you put the, the effort in from the way you talk to me. I know what, um, what your plans um, for test cricket, you know, how you go about your game. And I look up to you a lot. I always, you know, on the you having a chat, we laugh, you know, and when, when it's time to play cricket, yeah, um, you're a serious guy, and I like how you how you go about your business. And I'm following in your footsteps. So I would love to take 200 test wickets, to reach that milestone also. And I just want to finish off by saying, you know, thank you for everything you have done for me, you know, so far in my career. Um, and right now I'm at, I'm at the top with you, and I'd like to stay here with you for however long you have. And I'd like you to reach whatever number or whatever milestone you have in your mind when you looking to leave or retire. Have a good one. Congrats again. Seeing you as the under 15 player back in Barbados, I always knew you had the potential. Um, you went on to play under 19 for West Indies cricket. And I was chairman of the selectors when you made your first class debut. So our history goes a long way back. And I've seen you grow from a boy into a man, from a promising fast bowler into a great fast bowler. So well done. I just want to say thank you to Jason for his support as my skipper. Um, it was always good to play with you, man. Um, I came back into the side, you were the skipper, and I think you're doing a fantastic job. And I just want to keep the go from strength to strength, keep supporting the guys around you, and keep being the person you are, man. Thanks. I want to say thank you to Roderick, Roddy Eswick, um, bowling coach. Um, he's seen me from the time I was young, 17, 16 years old, and he knows my game tall, so have him here um, to lend his advice and for someone who's so knowledgeable about cricket and about fast bowling. It's obviously a, it's, it's great for me and I'm, I'm sure he can lend a lot more advice to the, to the future of West Indies fast bowlers and 
obviously get into the stage I'm at or surpass that. So I also want to say thank you to Ian Bishop. Um, we've had a lot of conversations over the years and I know you strongly believe in me and my ability and you've lent this fantastic advice and a lot of support. So to you, I want to say thank you and I'll try to go as much as I can, as long as I can and give wrestling a lot more success. So thanks again. I want to say thank you to two West Indies legends, Sir Curtly Ambrose and Courtney Walsh for all the kind commemorations, all the support you guys have done, um, have given me over the years. I think to have you guys behind me, obviously acknowledging my milestone, obviously being there to celebrate and obviously congratulate me is a great feeling and I'm going to try my best to go for 250, 300, probably 100 test matches. So let's see how that goes. I also want to say thank you to all the Maroon fans out there. Um, it's a good feeling to be in this club and all the support you guys have given me over the years. All the advice you lent over Instagram or whatever is obviously great. And I want to thank you for all you've done and all the support you've given to the team as well. And I just want to say I'm, I'll keep going as long as I can and to give you some more success and some more things to celebrate. So thank you. Coming from Kimaru.